Hey friends. So I know you're probably like, we're starry now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm actually in Nashville. Um, I don't know if I told you guys I was uh, leaving Uchi Pines just for a quick little break. It's an amazing story how I got here. God is good. But um, I'm in Nashville and I'm at a convention. It's a religious liberty convention. And um, I'm going to be actually um, at a booth. We're going to be handing out um, wonderful literature to all these people who are who believe in religious liberty, believe in our God-given rights, and um, I'm excited. I'm excited. So quick, the the line starts here apparently. But um, look at this truck. I said, oh, this guy's from. Texas and look he's got a Jesus sticker on so uh, it's going to be exciting the Lord already um, was preparing my heart this morning for this convention he gave me a lot from um, the book of Revelation and it, it talked a lot about truth truth and God's word so we'll see um, we'll see if I have any encounters you know the Lord uses us in a bold way if we ask him and you know I'm always asking but um, I'll, I'll have little clips here and there and I guess Trump Jr. is going to be here and a whole bunch of other um, people. General, General. And who? General Flynn. General Flynn. I don't know who he and is. The and the Trump staff. <laughs> I don't know. I was just talking to my friend here about Elon Musk. It was just last month that I, I discovered who Elon Musk was. So, you know, I'm a little slow on the draw, but that's okay. <laughs> so, but all right, we're going to, I'll, uh, I'll be uh, keeping you guys updated. So real quickly, we, um, this this wonderful truck in back of us in front of us just had an encounter with the guy who lives actually right over there I don't think you can see his house anymore but you see the line of traffic right well the unfortunate thing is this lady in front of us um, had her head stuck out the window and at the guy who owns this property and apparently she was screaming at him because he had a whole bunch of wood chips on the side of the road and he puts them there apparently to keep all because he says when there's an event they come and park on his lawn and drive all over and he so I felt compelled obviously to unroll the window and talk about Christ and the love of Christ and love thy neighbor and he says yeah these people don't you know they don't have that and I'm like yeah but you you got to pray for them because they're I mean so I don't know if my words helped at all but it's really sad that we're going to a religious freedom and here we have all these people and yeah I, I mean, it, we're, so we just prayed for um, for you know softening of hearts and uh, God's spirit to be here but I'm telling you just because all these people are here for religious freedom does Lord and doesn't mean you know remember what the Bible says about a form of godliness a form of godliness they will have a form of godliness they'll look the look they'll be going to conventions like this but will they really know the Lord and her true spirit just came out with a neighbor here on the way to the religious the, 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 you know Conferences. conference <laughs> thank you yeah yeah they think they do God service when they kill you so here we go you know we really have to be walking in 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 God's spirit when when we I mean this is why we're here I, I really believe that God brought us here and we may be seeing more of that but uh, this is why so many people are disillusioned and disappointed because I'm so sorry they're walking around and driving with Jesus stickers and that was an embarrassment an embarrassment for that lady uh, she needs prayers